Hey, it's Captain Matt with Boater Secret Weapon. It's National Safe Boating Week, and today we're going to talk about boating at night and your navigation and your anchor light. Anytime that you're operating your boat from an hour before dusk till an hour after dawn, you need to have your lights on. So that is your red green navigation light and your 360 degree white light could be one or it could be two um, that's at the highest point of your boat. Now this is important to keep only those two lights on when you're underway. You need to make sure that those lights are unobstructed which means any other light, uh, underwater lights, uh, cockpit lights, docking lights for sure need to stay off when you're running. The reason for that is, is one, it can cause night blindness for the other boaters, but two, it can obstruct your navigation lights so they don't know what's happening. We talk about this in the Best Boat Captain program um, and in our, um, in our other programs, but the red-green-white setup is going to allow you to know which direction a vessel is going just by seeing their light. So you don't need to see anything else other than, I know if the vessel is passing this way, I'm going to see a green and a white, and it's going to be going this direction. I know if I see a red and a white, it's going to be crossing this way because I'm seeing the red light, which is on the left side or the port side, and the white light, which is at stern, and I can see 360. If I'm following a boat and I only see a white light, well, that tells me that they're going away from me. If I see red and green and white, well, now I know that boat's coming almost directly at me. So that is why those lights are so important and why it's important to keep your other lights off in the vessel that you're running. Another little tip is the darker you keep it inside your boat, the easier it is for your eyes to adjust and see what's going on out on the water, the important part, right? So by keeping your lights down in your boat, all of the fun LED lights, the cockpit lights, even the some of the navigation lights, I'll oftentimes put a t-shirt or a towel over some of my screens so that I can see what's happening out in the water, okay? So what's important to know about your navigation light? One, you gotta make sure that they're working anytime that you might be out past that dusk marker out before dawn. Sometimes a trip lasts a little longer than you expect. Sometimes you, you know, you're running late or you have a mechanical issue and you stay out later. So always test those before you're going out. You may need to cup your hands around those navigation lights to see them. Uh, you may need to climb up on a seat to get to the, to the anchor light, but double check that they're working. Maybe carry a spare bulb if they're the, the bulb kind. If you're in an LED, they're much easier these days and much more reliable. But the red-green lights need to be seen 225 degrees around. That's the arc that they need to be visible. So that's 112.5 on each side. The, the red and the green are going to be shown 112.5 degrees on each side. With the center line, you'll see both of them. And then as you go from side to side, you're going to see just one or the other. So carry those extra bulbs. And you also, you may, if you do a lot of night boating, you may want to get um, a secondary, a backup light that uh, you can use just in case. Now, this isn't necessary for all boaters, uh, but they do make them, and it's something that you can easily plug in and use if you need them. So before you go out, one of your first times this year, definitely before you go out towards the evening or the early morning, do a double check on those lights. Make sure they're working properly. If you need to replace them, we got a bunch of them down below uh, that you can check out. We also have the portable versions. But remember, white light, 360 degrees around at the top of the boat, the highest point, and the red-green navigation lights up that you can see, 225 degrees total, 112.5 on each one, and you'll be in good condition. Now you also know what those light mean when you're out on the water and why it's so important to be able to see them. Uh, you pass red to red, uh, just like you do during the day, and you'll be safe out on the water at night. Remember, life truly is better on a boat.